are getting bored with a traditional keto breakfast like scrambled eggs, bacon, avocado, you need to try something different, something simple, sweet and delicious. And today I am going to show you how to make my three favorite rice cauliflower oatmeal. Yes, I know, rice cauliflower oatmeal sounds weird, but uh, I promise you these recipes um, taste uh, delicious and it takes a few minutes from start to finish. Before I start cooking, I wanted to show you something. Look at nutrition facts for raw cauliflower, raw oats and mine uh, chocolate cinnamon rice cauliflower oatmeal. You must be surprised, right? My two cups of chocolate cinnamon rice cauliflower oatmeal has almost three times less calories and three times less carbs than one cup of raw oats. Isn't that amazing? So, if you are looking for low in calories, uh, low carbs recipes for breakfast, this video is for you. I am getting hungry, so let's get started. Actually, I will use a different pot. Okay, I am going to place uh, rice cauliflower into my pot. I bought this rice cauliflower in, a, in the store. The easiest way is to get frozen rice cauliflower from the store. It's available almost in every store. Now I am going to pour coconut milk. and cook for about seven minutes, but we don't want this uh, rice to um, get mushy. In this recipe, I am using uh, this milk that has a little bit less uh, fat content, but for the richer and creamer consistency and texture, you can use any milk you like, even the one from a uh, can, like coconut milk from can. Or, if you like, you can use almond milk as well. In the meanwhile, I am mixing collagen powder that is great source of protein with uh, war gum. You can skip war gum if you don't like. I love it because it's giving us the texture almost like uh, oatmeal. One scoop of uh, protein powder and one fourth of teaspoon of guar gum. All the ingredients uh, for each recipe will be posted below the video. A quick tip for you, if you use powder gums like guar gum, xandam gum, in the recipe, they have a tendency to form lump if we mix them with water, so it is important to blend them with other dry ingredients before we add them to our dish. Now I am adding uh, cacao powder, cinnamon, powder, Keto sweetener, I am using Swerve and cook for about one more minute. Wow, I love the smell, it's so delicious. Now I am turning off the heat. and sprinkle collagen mixture and stir until it is dissolved. It's almost ready! 
look at this texture it's uh, getting thicker exactly like I want it Wow, I forgot about something. We need to use salt, sea salt, just to enhance the flavors. Now it's time for serving. Oh my God, I am hungry. This smells amazing, delicious. You see, this is really big bowl of food for breakfast and you can eat guilty free because low in calories and low in carbs. You can top our oatmeal with um, any keto compliance uh, topping you like, like berries, co cacao, nips, uh, uh, sh shredded uh, coconut, some uh, uh, keto friendly butters like uh, peanut butter, almond butter, whatever you like. I like simple, so I will sprinkle just the dust of cinnamon. Voila! This is the first flavor chocolate cinnamon. Now it's time for matcha rice cauliflower flavor. Matcha will give us extra kick in the morning, so I cannot wait. The base uh, is same. I am putting my rice cauliflower. Coconut milk. while our cauliflower, our oatmeal are getting ready, let me dissolve matcha uh, on the side. This is important step because we just want to prevent, avoid the uh, lumps uh, in our dish. Just a little bit. Okay. Beautiful. I don't want to forget about uh, salt, so it's a good time to add it right now. Okay, our rice is ready. So let me turn off the heat. I am going to add our oops. I am going to add our matcha and vanilla extract. We almost done. We almost done. Sprinkle with our collagen mixture. I am putting the uh, keto sweetener. Now it's time for serving. Mm, I will top matcha oatmeal with melted coconut butter you see the consistency is solid so I will mix with melted coconut oil I love this the flavor combination 
we will have matcha coconut butter and strawberries you can also add um, raspberries or blueberries I will decor this with strawberries okay and we pour the melted coconut butter wow now it's time for almond salt meals Base is same. Now I am adding uh, almond butter. And keto sweetener. I am using Swerve. about one more minute until all ingredients are combined I am adding almond extract and stirring the last thing is to sprinkle the collagen mix I am using for topping blueberries pecans And we can drizzle with uh, almond butter. So this is pretty much it for this video. I love all of all three recipes. Uh, please let me know in the comment which one you would like to try or maybe you can share with us your oatmeal, uh, keto oatmeal uh, ideas uh, below in the comment. So thank you so much for watching this video and if you like my channel please subscribe to my channel and see you in the next one. Bye! Oh, 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 oh,